So we're in one tree in Bendelong and we have been urchin hunting today. Uh, we've caught some of these urchins and this is Centro Stephanus regersii, Centro for friends. It was beautiful. There was lots of um, crayweed, lots of kelp, lots of cystophora and there were lots of different species of urchins actually. Yeah, we caught a few different species to show people the difference. So this one is Heliosidaris tuberculata. And that one, there's not that many of, so that's not one that we want to normally catch. This is Centro, this is the one that we want to focus on. But there's also lots of these little ones, um, which are Heliosidaris erythrogramma. And that one is, a, is an okay one to eat, actually, but um, at a different time of the year. So this one is good late summer now, and this one is better in the late winter kind of spring. And what we're going to do now is we're going to open it and we're going to eat it. We're going to eat the gonads. <laughs> Ooh, what's that? Yeah, so this is the uni, which is the yellow bits. It's the delicious uni. And right now it's super good time to be catching this because they're really full. So that's the seaweed that it's kind of feeding on. So that's the gut. And um, the, when you catch them near seaweed, that's when, you know, that's when they have the fattest kind of gonads and um, yeah so this is the bit that you eat and there's five of these but like the, I mean the reason why I like doing it in the ocean is that you can kind of wash it straight away and you want to do those? you want to? yes okay do you want I can just put it next to it's actually really nice yeah there we go thank you mm. So fresh, so good. It is so good, isn't it? It's is really good. Mm. There we go. Oh, maybe not this. Yeah. Try not to eat the red bit. <laughs> T tonight, what we're going to do is we're going to do a screening of white rock, um, and then there's going to be a feast, a bit of a cook up. We're going to have uni pasta. A lot of people are going to have urchins for the first time in their life, and the idea is to encourage them to eat as much urchin as as, as we can. <laughs> So it's basically to show people the overabundance of Centro in some parts of the coastline and how they are damaging kelp forests it's in, in some, some parts of the coastline. And for people to familiarize themselves with what they look like, what the seaweeds around them look like, and, and what they taste like, yeah. <laughs> 